Griffin and this is a really different post today. Today I'm actually going to uh, tell you guys about my techniques for dream interpretation. Now this is not based out of any formal psychological training. In fact there's a lot of people out there who would say that by the time someone's come out of the end of a uh, psychology course they basically know less than they went in with and not in the I have eliminated my misunderstandings way. So today I'm going to tell you about dreams. I'm actually going to split this up into a mini playlist uh, and I'm going to split it up by categories. Now let me preface everything I'm going to say by explaining that the human mind looks for patterns and it tries to create analogies to things. Most of your dream is wordplay fleshed out with visual metaphors. And when people repress memories in some cases, not all, Though in some cases, they will dream about situations that have the same pattern or flow to it and insert elements uh, that remind them of what really happened. In the case of most people worrying about stuff, usually they'll see whatever it is they're worried uh, about with a visual metaphor of what they think is going wrong or what they think needs to be fixed thrown in there. In a lot of cases, a dream is your mind trying to connect the dots and trying to see a bigger pattern. It's just very, very expressive and in some cases it can be very, very confusing. So I'm doing this playlist just to try and uh, show people what's going on in your head and hopefully give you some tools you can use to try and understand a three-step process that I use. Anyway, my three steps are identify the elements of the dreams, people, places, and things. Put that all together as uh, the visual plays on words so that you just look at the ball of plays on words together. Then try and summarize that down to the f uh, third and final step where you try and diagnose what the dream's trying to tell you. Anyway, I'll get into uh, people, places, and things in just a minute, and I'll do a separate video on each. I hope this has been really helpful to you, and I certainly hope um, that if anyone thinks they can do better, please get in touch with me. I'd love to revise my technique. Have a good one, and good luck.